I'm over here by the potato grow bags and I just thought I would uh, go ahead and show what a potato beetle looks like. I've been picking off a few once in a while and more importantly than what a potato beetle looks like I wanted to show what their eggs look like. For, but first let's uh, look at one of the beetles. And what I've been doing is just hand picking those. You can you can take a um, like a small container with some soapy water and just drop them in it. That'll take care of them pretty quickly. I've got two of them right here close by each other. And once you notice those on your potato plants, if you start looking around on the bottom sides of the leaves, you might find some eggs. The thing about these eggs is they look almost exactly like a ladybug's egg. So if, if you are thinking they might be a ladybug's egg, I would get rid of them anyway because of their location. Uh, ladybugs will almost always lay their eggs where there's an aphid infestation on a plant because that's... Uh, the larva's food source. Now when it comes to potato beetles, uh, their food source is the potato vegetation, so it's a whole different situation. Uh, so I just automatically assume that when I find these eggs on a potato plant that they are from the potato beetle. And the best thing to do is while you're removing your potato be beetles and drop them in the soapy water you can just take the leaves off and do the same thing with those the ones with eggs and I right here next to this leaf with eggs if I look down here I've got another one so what I need to do is carefully go over these leaves and uh, flip them over and get rid of these eggs before they hatch I just wanted to show what the eggs look like because they do look like just like a ladybug's egg and if uh, you ran into them thinking they're ladybug's egg uh, eggs on your potato plant just assume they are from the potato beetle and I'm not sure but I'm thinking this is probably Colorado potato beetle I'm not really up on my potato beetles very much but I got some hand picking to do. I found two leaves and it seems like, yeah, there's another one over here. So I need to go over all of these potato plants and get rid of any eggs that I find. Here's a look at what I'm using. I just use a paper bowl with a few drops of dishwashing liquid and some water. And I drop the eggs in there and the beetles. And the beetles, they don't last very long. Uh, that soapy water takes care of them pretty quickly. That's about all there is to it. And one nice thing about the color of the eggs is they're pretty easy to spot. So you just have to keep an eye on them and pick them off when you see them. That's about all there is to it. One thing I thought I should mention before we go is... Uh, the potato beetle can also feed on any other member of the nightshade family, which would include eggplants and tomato plants. So you don't want to get, let them get out of hand or they might be a bigger problem than just your potatoes. I just want to share this and hopefully it'll help some folks out there. And if you're just now finding this channel and haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Otherwise like, comment and share. We'll see you next time.